Hello everybody, my name is Zoot, and welcome back to Night in the Woods, Weird Autumn. I think we're near the end. Pretty sure we're near the end. I feel a burp coming out. Burp. Why won't it come out of my butt? Out of my butt. Out of my butt. Why won't a burp come out of my butt? Probably a good idea, because I have a smell in my room, and I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want door. Door. Tunnel. Whatever. Here we go. What's beyond door number one? Certain doom? Cultists? Certain doom and cultists? A brand new car? Probably not a brand new car. If it's down here, I don't trust a car. Ah, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something. And like, junk. Oh god. Oh god. What is it? It's here. It's here. Oh god. What is it? I don't know, but it's here. It's through here. What is? The cult leader? Are we gonna take out a cult leader? B, please put, please tell me you're gonna put out your cigarette on his face before Greg shoots him. That'd be cool. Not really, that'd be kind of mean. But you know, I'd still take it anyway because it's a cult leader. I know you're in here. Say something. Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. Show yourself! Yeah, so we're like five times scarier than you. Oh. You weren't kidding about the whole, like, take five steps forward. Hey, hey, you're right there. I'm gonna kill him. I know you'll do no such thing. It's out of our, it's out of your hands now. He shot me! Then I'd say we're even. Little girl got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. You're apologizing? It was a bad call, I'm sorry. Uh huh. It's okay? You didn't actually hit me, so. Wait, what the f. Who are you? Bunch of the old boys doing their damnedest to protect their town and their neighbors. Then why are you trying to kill me? Kill you? Nobody's gonna kill you? All of you are part of this town. By family relation or just by being hard workers. Contributors. Um, okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for a reason, and he's not going to let you leave until he's had his say. Well, he's already got an arrow through the shoulder. I don't think he's going to be having much say in whatever. Wait, so you think that Ida... He kidnapped that kid at Harfest. He's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired, constant headaches. He's been following me. Following all of us. He... Oh, little girl. You don't know what this is, do you? What? Oh, God. I've seen this. I felt it. It was Ed Scudder and Jim Dorney who found it. Twenty years back or so. After the West Mine closed down past Brittle. Vest Schumacher, last supervisor was out here when the company locked off the entrance. Carved his initials and date in the door. Then you got this mine, the old one. Not even a proper mine. Big hole, copper. Abandoned. Shoot, long before any of us were born. Too close to water. And that water was poison. When the first settlers came down, came out here, that old spring used to be right above where we're standing. That water dried up. 1992 or so, some men from West Mine. Come back up here to try bootlegging. Practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel cleared, never found no coal, just dug deeper and deeper. Till Ed busts through that wall and finds this place. And Jim walks right into that hole, and never hits bottom. Ed calls down to Jim. Jim don't answer. But someone else does. I know you heard that voice, girl. In dreams and in waking times. Sweat so brought you down here. What... what is it? 
black goat. Not even black like the color. Black like the space between the stars. He's down there, in that hole. Looking up at us right now. He don't talk to you. He sings. Why would you just do something a hole in a cave told you to do? You gotta understand. In those days, it was the end of the world. Jobs gone, our kids were leaving. Government didn't care, only wanted our votes. Still kind of the case. That's all they care about. Just putting in more regulations, sending our jobs overseas, spending our taxes on lazy people and immigrants. Oh, we worked ourselves to death. Ugh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? No. Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up at the church. When Ed Scudder came down here, came back down here and listened, he got answers back. Answers? Ed explained it to a few folks, and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. The glimmer. The ones he takes a shine into. It rubs off on you. You can do things. I never seen it. They said Ed could walk through walls. Okay. Okay, sure. He, he can walk through walls. That's cute. Does he burst through them? Does he become the Kool-Aid man and just burst through them and that's how he walks through a wall? Because that's the way to walk through... That's a real life way to walk through a wall. You punch a hole through it and then you walk through the hole in the wall. And you've walked through the wall. That, that's how that works. Science would do! Yeah. After Ed talked us into all this, after that first time, after we picked one out, well, not only was the town holding stable, but it was almost like we were getting younger, and money came too. Still a few of us left from back then. Picked? First one was Tom Turner. Who believe you me was a bastard. Just pure trash. We got him down here, and in the hole he went. Next week, flowers blooming all over the hills. You throw them into the hole. They're feeding him. He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few months or so, he starts singing. And someone who someone's turned to find someone. Is that what you're doing the other night? No. What happened the other night was a shame. One of our number broke the rules and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm gonna be sick. We never pick no one who's gonna be missed. That's a solid rule. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. You've been... Oh, God. Oh, no. How many people have died down here? Oh, I'd say... Three dozen, give or take. Thirty-nine. Am I the only one keeping a steady count? I do now. Early on, I think we all wanted to forget. Still got a feel in heart. It still hurts. And that dirtbag kid from the spring. C Casey? The Hartley kid? All he was going to contribute to society except a bunch of kids go growing up with no dad. It was a rap sheet a mile long. He's Casey's dead. For whatever sad end he'd wind up at. We did him a favor. You killed Casey. Oh my god. We don't use that word. You know he was taking up business with his cousin, right? You know what happened to his cousin? Burned alive with when his little trailer lab exploded. They had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up. That's where Casey was headed. You killed Casey. And you want to act like we didn't do him and this whole town a favor. God, Casey's been down here the whole time. His parents put up posters. Maybe they should have cared more about him before it came to this. Which one of you did it? Which one of you did it? It was my friend! Alright now, throw it down or I'll sh Throw it down right now or I will shoot. <laughs> what if I get you first? Bolt sticking right out of your eye. brought guns down here. Dangerous this far out in the woods at night. Basic safety. Hey, hey, throw it down, son. Don't make this our time. Rag. Dang it. Your 
monsters. None of this... None of this is happening. We are not monsters. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this, Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. These mines are going to be humming again someday. Old mills puff and smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. It used to be you providing for our family. Bought a house. Now you're stocking shelves at the grocery store. Kids leaving more than they're staying. No opportunity here. Old people dying. Houses left empty. You ever seen that? A home become a pile, a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster. A job becoming a burned down brick box or a hole in the ground. But we can change that. We can put this place back together. Where it won't be just... Shapes. These people are fucking nuts! I'm going to die down here. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old. And even with the fringe benefit of good health, we need new blood to carry this on when we're gone. Really? You're like, pitching us on this? Were any of you even miners back in the day? Any of you hurting now, financially like? Or is this just some big costume party murder club for someone's shitty boss who's afraid of dying? That don't matter. Kinda does! Yeah, see? Kinda. This is real bad. This is insane. Why should we help you? Because if no one is here to do this, you remember that flood a few years back? You remember the blizzard of 2010? That's what happens. And beyond that, the jobs never come back. The kids never come back. Everything crumbles. Possum Springs bleeds to death. And soon we'll all be dead. And this town will be just fields and trees. I've seen it. I know you have. I'll understand if you need some time to think over it. So we can leave. No one's gonna stop you. Just understand that you don't know who we are out there. But we know who you all are. Ain't fair they get to leave and I probably- oh. Ain't fair that they get to leave and I probably got permanent damage. Shut it, Aid, Heidi. You don't know a thing about what he wants. What he is. Heidi, I swear to God. Let's go. Yeah, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I could bullshit you. But the truth is, I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever. It's a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> I can't move you guys. I'll carry you. I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just horror? That's not a word you get to use too often. That's all I've got left. Everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. Out first. Old, old stuff in here. It's not even a proper lift mechanism. There's no rope above the thing. How are we moving? Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey. Yeah. I... Yeah. And for what? I, I think I get it. Wow, really? Too tired to explain it right, but, like... They lost what they thought was gonna happen, which is what had happened, like, a long time ago. Or how they remember, or, like, picture it and things it gave them. And so, Casey and that kid at Harvest and... Sorry, I lost it. That's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. Ready to go again, Angus? Yeah, sorry. Wait, everyone shut up. What? Shh. I thought I... Oh god! Get off! Get off me! Get off me, you slut! Get off me, you slut! Kick your fucking face in! There we go. Oh, he dead. 
That was a bear person. That was a bear person, and... They're dead! Holy shit. Is everyone okay? May, May, are you okay? May, say something! <laughs> May? Okay, I've got you. He's gone now. Shit, how are we gonna get out of here? Ah! Swallow before you speak. Shh, give her a minute. Hey? I feel air coming in from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate! Yes! Okay, well that's a relief. How do you... I was a scout, Greg. I was a scout. Hey, Angus. Yeah, I love you. Aww. Welcome back, May. You okay? Better now that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is weird. <laughs> that was like the third time in two days. Third time's the charm! Guys, the air's coming from back here. Alright, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It's boarded up. A long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Push. Let's get out of here. Eh. Come on. Get McFuck, boy. There we go. Why don't we just punch through it? Yep, that's some fresh air, all right. <laughs> and water. Dude, that's amazing. You can smell water? Hopefully it's not a river. Can rivers... Cave rivers are death traps. Mine river. We're in a mine. Right. Same diff, really? Kinda? Not... Not really. Wow, we're slow. Uh, thank you guys for waiting up. Hmm. I can see the bottom. I don't think we're gonna die in the one foot of water. Alright. It's about three feet, maybe. We can also test that out by, like, carefully putting our feet into the water and, like, not, uh... You know... What? What? I know what you are now. I think I knew before. You know, after I sent that kid to the hospital years ago, I said I had an anger problem. That's not true. I was angry because of something else. We fell in the in a hole in the water and we're having a realization now. Something I lost, trying so hard since not since not to be angry, got me all defenseless, and I lost more and more and more. That's not getting better. I want to be angry. When I ran home, when I ran home from college, on the bus I had this dream. And maybe I saw it out the window. Last leaf on the tree, finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. Feeling like everything is over. Was just lo was over long before I got here. So long, hiding, or trying to outrun this. I get it. This won't stop. Until I die. But when I die... I want it to hurt. When my friends leave, when I have to let go, when this entire town is wiped off the map, I want it to hurt. Bad. I want to lose. I want to get beaten up. I want to hold on until I'm thrown off and everything ends. And you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again. And I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I am something at least. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something, at least. Uh, alien speak, okay. You know, I can't understand you, right? Oh, shut up already. I know this won't save me in the end, but I don't need it to save me forever. I just need it to save me now. 
So if you're gonna kill me right here, then do it. If not... May. Dude, you okay? Whoa. Get all sleepwalky there for a sec. You want me to carry you? No, I think I'm good. I'm just very, very tired. Hang here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Uh-huh. Hey, there's light over there. Did you smell that? I bet I did. <laughs> smell the light. Smell the light, Angus. It smells like light traveling at a high speed. I don't know. I don't know how light smells. I've never smelled light. What is this? Maybe a vent or something. Keep the miners from suffocating way back when. Looks old enough, at least. Eh? Brochure. Hello! We're down here! Don't ask us why, please. Could get lucky and someone's out there at the w in the woods at night. I, I can try to make it out. No, I can, like... Okay, yeah, are you up for this? Yeah, I don't know. I'm, like, all hyper now. Like, dolphins. Hyper like dolphins. No, like, when your body is like, Oh, whoa, I almost died! And you get all hyper because you're filled with dolphins. Okay, I'm seriously confused. Are you okay, May? You mean endorphins. Yeah, endorphins. Ah, okay. There, thank you! Those! Okay, well, ride those dolphins up out of there. Eh, that's assuming I can even do this. We'll watch. Okay. Jump. Jump! Jump a day, jump. Jump, 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 to freedom, May. You can do it. We believe in you. Do it, May. You can do it. It's it's a well. It's it's a well. We look like we just had a moment climbing up. It's great. This place. Huh. Hi, man. Charm? Yeah! What are you doing out here? I live right up the hill. I heard Greg yelling. We were all stuck down there. You were at the bottom of the old well in my backyard? It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Got any rope or something? Yeah. Did you... Can you go get it? <laughs> hey, May. Yeah? Was that germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? Apparently, yeah. He lives in the woods. <laughs> My entire body hurts. That was a long way. Brought some sodas. You're the best, germ. You need the sugar and caffeine. I don't think that's entirely true. Uh... Anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yup! Jim, can you like, I don't know, seal up this well? Hmm. I got dynamite! What? Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small? Okay, that works. Thanks, Jim! Yeah, thanks, buddy. Um, okay. Bye, guys. There goes a weird, weird guy. He saved our lives. German's good. German's a good man. That, that he is. A weird good man. It strikes me that we just got murdered all... That we just murdered all those dudes down there. How do you figure? Well, I mean, the elevator's broken and we caused a cave-in. That was self-defense. I guess, but we did cause the death of like a dozen guys. No, 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 they're all still alive down there. Oh, God. Yeah. Jeez. Well, we're blameless. They attacked us. One of them, anyway, attacked us. So we're worrying about, like... It's morally gray! We're not murderers! Yay! Yay! We didn't kill anybody. Or we did kill people, but we're not murderers. Like, if we'd had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. Right? I would've. Uh... 
What? They like killed people. They were trying to get us to kill people. Screw them. I don't even believe in hell and I hope they all go straight there. Jeez, Angus. That's what I think, at least. This is like that trolley thing. What trolley thing? Okay, I'll explain it if we keep walking. I want to know what this trolley thing is. And I still want to hear Go Get Dead Angel Face. I want that. Oh. Hey, guys. Uh, are you there? Anyone? Okay, I'm gonna type anyway. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell even just happened. Easier for me to just get it all out there. And I need to talk. Even if you jerks are off doing whatever. None of us asked for any of this. And it didn't happen to us because we're, like, special. You can work as hard as you want, but the universe is gonna keep doing what it does. And I don't think any of us deserved all this. This is all stuff that started long before we were born. And it's all, like, moving so fast and you're dropped into it, and you're just trying to grab onto something. All of you are what keep me from floating off, or what kept me from floating off tonight. Also, you kind of killed that guy to save him. Don't think I didn't appreciate that. LOL. <laughs> you guys killed people for me. I don't know if I'm ever going to understand what all just happened. I hope it stopped. I just feel right now like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you. Not just because I love you, but to keep you all together with me. Wrap up into, wrap up into a ball and no one can hurt us. Sorry, I'm rambling. Wrap us all up into a ball and spin dash. Jerm, buddy. Jerm, you don't even use Messenger. Guess I'm just typing at you wherever you're at. B, you're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I don't even understand all of your problems. But if I could fix them, I'd fix all of it. And I'd buy the tools to do it from your store. Or, like, borrow them at least. A better friend would buy, but I'm what you got. And I'm glad. Yep, there it is. Nah, I'm just gonna erase all that. Oh shit. Eh, guys, I was just kidding about a lot of that. I'm really tired, I don't know what I'm saying. Log off, May. Log off! Log off! We just confessed to B, didn't we? Let's be honest, we probably just confessed to B. Wake up, May! We gotta go deal with the repercussions of last night. What? Uh, what? Oh, God. Oh, there's no more than that. It's all just shapes, and there's that. Okay. I like that bombshell chick. We play some bass, but which song? Anywhere else? Cycles. Good autumn TikTok pumpkin head guy. TikTok? Cycles? What are these two songs? That song. You know, that song. I have no idea what the song is. What the fuck? I've never heard the song! Oh, is this the one where we're chasing after B? That's cool, we can play it! Fuck yeah, dude! Well, I tried, it didn't work. Fuck. I don't know what the... I feel like there should be lyrics to this and I want to hear them. Eh. Eh. Fuck. Fuck, I'm bad at this. 
Okay, now I've got the rhythm. Fuck. Okay, I hope I got the rhythm now. Fuck. Yeah, this is... Shit. This is most definitely the song that plays when you're chasing B, but I did not know what it was called. And I love that I can play it. And I want to play the other one before I leave the... to go do whatever. I still want to play Go Get Dan Angel Face, though. Someone please do a cover of that song, or what they think the song would be. Something incredibly cringy and edgy and like something a teenager would sing. If they're trying to be cool. There we go. We did it! We did it! Not bad considering I don't know how to play the song. What? What? Oh, cool thing! Cool thing! Cool thing! We got we got another thing. Maybe one more. A witch song. Space Dragon Nell. TikTok. Ah, yes, TikTok. That terrible charity parody song about telling time. Punched up the lyrics with a bit with Greg back in high school. Let's see if I can remember all the words. There's words. Oh my god. This is gonna be weird, isn't it? Fuck! Fuck, I can't get it! Fuck. Ah, I wish I could read the lyrics, but I can't right now! Ugh! Eh, 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 eh. Uh. Fuck! It's weird. How do I? What? Fuck! I I'm I have no rhythm to this. Fuck. Uh. Fuck. Uh. Okay, I think I got it sort of, but like not enough. Fuck. This is going to take some time to, like, perfect, and I want to go back and... Fuck! How do I... Ah. This is weird! Ah. I'm losing any rhythm that I would have had before. Fuck. Uh, when does the song end? Does it end? I feel like it should have ended by now. Huh? There. It's over. Oh my god, Charity Parody, you're an asshole! I literally do not know the song. Yeah, I don't. Oh my god, I do not know the song. Ow, my wrist. 
Uh, okay. So, there it comes. Away message. It's good to be alive this morning. That's all. Hey, man. Nice messages last night. I mean, like, really, you massive dork. <laughs> Band practice today. Because I feel like we need to do something normal. I'm at the Snalkin. Hope you're feeling okay. Sincerely, Gregory. Alright, B, what you got? Hey, May. You okay this morning? I'm not opening the pickaxe today. Greg informs me we're doing band practice, though. I'll see you there. Well, I guess we're doing band practice. Away we go! Epilogue. Stars. Wait. Stars? Are we gonna play another song? After the two I just finished? <laughs> Wait, let me check something real quick. We went in here before. We get to we get to venture in here and find something new. Please tell me we do. No, no, nothing new. Shit. Might have been awesome to find something new. Something really cool. Would have loved it. Would have loved it indeed. Okay. May, honey, is that you? Yeah, I'm back in the kitchen if you want to talk. I would love to talk, mother of mine. Let's go talk. Hello, mom. Hey, sweetie. Hey, mom. How you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Sure. I, you're an adult and you can do whatever you want, but you do live here and you are still my baby. Ah, um, mom. Um. We need to come up with some ground rules, just because... Honey, you could have died the other night. And then you just left to hang out with your friends? I... I... I'm so sorry, Mom. Sweetie, what's going on with you? I've had a really tough year, Mom. I mean, you've had a tough week. We all have. Yeah, but... What happened at school, hun? I don't care what it is, just please tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight. Can we talk about it then? Sure. We can make breakfast for dinner just like we used to. Dad can flip the pancakes in the air! Sure. Yay! Are you going out today? Yeah. Can you please stay in town? Close? Yeah, Mom. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh, wow. Calling for some snow, too. That went fast. What did? The fall. Always does, huh? Okay, well, I'm off. Love you, sweetie. Love you too, Mom. Wait, any other things we could say before we go? Are you still reading the same book? Oh no, this is a different one. This one's about people who died in the mines around here. Ah, oh, cool, cool. That is very interesting. It's got some old songs. Want to hear one? Sure. Far from here, the ocean's roaring. Far away across the din. I hear the Lord a-calling their children. Bring it in, bring it in. I'll see you walking through the barley. We'll find each other friend and kin. I hear the Lord a-calling their children. Bring them in, bring them in. Tarry with me for a moment. Talk the places we've been. The Lord will call us both to heaven. Bring them in, bring them in. What? That's nice. It is, it is nice. No, it's not. It's pretty terrifying. And foreshadowing what uh, transpired earlier. <laughs> hey, Dadams. What's up? Hey, Dad. Don't work today? I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll be fine. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. I hate my job. Aw, uh, Dad, why? I've mined, I've made glass, I've done a heap of other stuff. But this place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Boss's supposed to respect you. Worker's supposed to be able to talk. Worker's supposed to be able to have a life. Worker's supposed to be able to live. Your mom always had to work, but I wanted to give you and her your time. Your time. I wanted her to have hobbies. And enough time to, and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I can keep our health insurance. And hold on to, our, to the house. Try to, at least. Is there anything you can do? I mean, we do need a union. It's just easier to say it than get it done. Unions were always there in the mines and the factory, at least for a while. But here? Listen, I'm gonna be around tonight for dinner. Wow, what's the occasion? 
Well, Mom said we could make breakfast. Ooh, sounds good. I was gonna talk about some stuff. Okay. We can talk about your stuff, too? Just one big, uh, stuff session? Sounds great, kidden. Love you, Dad. Love you, too. Be back later. Oh. Let's do one more talking. What are you doing out here, by the way? I didn't know you start on our longest night lights plan. Gotta dig them out of the closet. See if they still work. See if they work still. Can I put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry. Dad. Dum -de dum Oh, that's it. Okay. Okay, fine. Hey, Officer Bob Brady. Or Butt Brady. Hey, what are you doing here? I'm working, May. Sure. <sighs> What's wrong? Don't ask. A lot of weird calls this morning. What kind of calls? Question. If you haven't seen... Never mind. Go do whatever it is you do. Okay, fine, I will. Hey. Spit it out already! Be careful. Just be careful. Well, geez, until now I never considered that. Hey. Okay, fine, thanks, bye. Thanks, Aunt Butt Brady. Totally calling you Aunt Butt Brady. Salmers! How you doing, boy? You okay? After the whole, like, head injury thing? Yeah, I'm alright. Headache is all. You got some migraine meds if you need it. Nah, it's not a migraine. Those things make me have to pee. It's the caffeine. If you ever take pills that make you pee, it's the caffeine. I didn't know that. Used to work at the pharmacy. Had to pee all the time. If I ever had a headache or I need to pee, I'll come by. <laughs> Anytime, neighbor. We got any poems? No poetry? Fuck! Doesn't really answer the question, Colleen. Thank you very- That very much does answer the question. The amount of rock salt isn't the problem. We don't have enough damn trucks for this thing. Cars slip sliding all up and down this goddamn hill, Colleen. Half time to just close the roads when the storm hits. Oh yeah, good. Let's just give up. It's not giving up, Colleen. I'm sick of you undermining me. It's a bad idea. It's not undermining. It's undermining. I'm on Colleen's side on this one. Duh. Well, that's just great. It's just peachy pie, ain't it? Okay, fine. Well, we'll just close all the roads. Let's close down the whole damn town. Your ideas are always the most important and the most thought out. <laughs> We're gonna do another water balloon toss? I nearly froze to death last time. I still have the sniffles. I think we can all agree that it's too cold for water balloons. Yeah, Kathleen, too cold for another stupid idea. What the hell, Colleen? You just hire some private plows. If you want to go against the DOT union, go right ahead. You got agreements with the country, with the county and state. Colleen's right on this one too. If you two agree so much, why don't you just get married already? Ugh! I'd rather die. I'm going to break my own femurs with a cinder block. All right, well now that's settled. Why? What are we doing out in the road? Break for food? Great idea. I'm starving. So we can still make decisions. Huh? <laughs> Move out, troops. Oh, they aren't gonna have a coffee smoke spit? Lame! Where are they going? 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 Gonna stock these four people. Find out where they're going to eat. Because it's fun. Oh, they're gone? They're gone. Okay, fine. Are these the coffee smokes people? So I'm gonna split part time. How do they not have the hours? It's a huge store, how do they not have hours? They got a computer program. It's all hooked up to some kind of mainframe or something. It spits out the uh, the optimum schedule for all the employees. Manager can't do much about it. Computer don't play favorites. And I guess you can't argue with a computer. Did Nancy give you hell? Nah, she just laughed though. She did laugh though. I laughed too. You're still gonna do that movie? Now let's find a night where we're all off. I'm off Tuesdays. I'm off Sundays. Thursday is my only night off. Coffee smokes? You can all put in requests? Coffee smokes. Coffee smokes. Coffee smokes. Coffee smokes. Coffee smokes. Coffee smokes. There we go. That's enough of that. 
Yes, we're open, but the but it wasn't open. Hey, repairman, how's it going? Hey, it's you. How's it going? Yep, yep. For now, at least. You know, I never got your name. I'm the janitor. I clean up, do fix-its. Whatever needs doing. Oh, okay. So what's it like being home again? Things you la things like you remember them? No. I don't know. I don't even remember today. Sounds like you've been through something. How did you know? Call it experience. I swear some mornings I feel every bit as old as these trees. You know, something big did happen. And I feel like I should have woken up today. And, like, have learned something. But I don't know if I learned anything, really. Well, in my experience, the big things don't teach you anything. But they make you something. And sometimes you gotta wait a while and see what come of it. Huh. No more death cults, at least. Well, done an honest day's work. Quitting time. Smelter's game tonight. See you around. Not if I see you first, May. Ha 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 Wait, how'd you know my name? Janitor, Mr. Janitor, Lord Janitor, Bob Janitor. Thought I could get a job as a janitor and really enjoy it. I don't think that's how that works. But whatever, man. Whatever floats your goat. I guess. Hey, buddy boy, who are you? Well, Father sure is ending. Sure looks that way. I've uh, never seen you around before. I spent a lot of time indoors, but it's nice to take a break. And I like the cold. It's brisk today. Brisk. Sometimes I stand out in the cold with my arms out, and let a gust of wind pass over me. Chills me out a bit. Like this? I do that too sometimes. That is nice. Yeah. Is it working? A little bit. It's cold. Maybe too cold. Yeah, you don't want to be doing it for too long. But then you can go get go and get a coffee or a hot chocolate or something. The endless cycle of life. It's cozy. The endless cozy cycle of life. Jeez. I hadn't thought about how cold it was getting here until you mentioned it. It's snowing. I know. Sorry. You don't have to apologize. I'm from Canada. I have to apologize. Oh. I'm gonna put my arms down now. That's probably a good idea, eh? The blood roll ran out of my arms. Okay. Numb arms. Numb arms indeed. That was an interesting character. Uh, Angus Pangus, are you in here? Angity Pangity Poo. He's not here. Wait, what is that? Death ch Oh, it's the ski thing. And for a second I thought the, uh, death chill board thing was, uh... Holy crap, a... Ah! Uh, a taco place! This is the best thing that's happened in this town since we got rid of all those snakes. We got internet. We were still using cyberfish until like two years ago because it's eternally two decades behind here. Takes you three days to torrent a movie. Takes you one day to load a GIF. Or GIF. Barbaric times. God. Life moves on, huh? Oh my god, they deliver! I'm gonna eat the shit out of some tacos. Hell to the yes. So you're a taco dude now? I mean, I was hired to be a taco artisan, but I guess that means holding the sign out in the snow. It's not really snowing that hard. It's snowing. There is snow in the sky falling. How are the tacos here? Good. I like tacos. There's not one person on God's earth who doesn't love tacos. Bad news. My ex hates tacos. Good news. They're now your ex. Heh <laughs> Have fun with the tacos. Eh, it pays. That does sound like a lot of fun. Kitty! With a rat person. I, I, I can own a cat and be a... Okay, sure. That We'll accept that. Who are you? Haven't you seen me around? Nah. Oh, I've noticed you. That's not weird or anything. A bit cold for standing outside, isn't it? Someone's gotta stand here. Hey, you Smelters fan? Uh, yeah. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. No Smelters? Go smelters! Go smelters. Sounds like a cult thing when you think about it. Oh my god, I can get up here! I can get up here! Oh my god! I never knew I could. Huh? Ah, I could get on the diner! 
And now I can't. Damn it. That's fine, I guess. Let's go to the snack and get this music going. Let's finish this up! Hey, Gregums. A look who's alive and well. Is that a surprise? Nah. Just seems like relevant. A look who's alive and well to you, too. Yeah, yeah. You wanna get out of here? Do band practice? Hell to the yes, boy! Yes, I do! Wanna see what we got now, if I can play anything. Hopefully we can play stuff. That's something important. God, the store just does not like to open. And it's worse in the summer. Did you get all the keys back to the back door? I got one and we made copies. How do you even get a key? I have no idea. He probably broke in and found a key. And then tried it and then found and then found that it was the back door key and then made a copy of it. Where's Greg? Oh uh, yeah, he had this spring Angus from work. What does that mean? Zero clue. He was gonna go we were they were gonna have the butt sex at work and then come on over. Huh. I'm a little unclear about how both of them still have jobs, since they seem to just up and leave work early a lot. There's a lot about those two I don't understand. I think they just plain need each other. Greg more than Angus, I think. I don't think Angus would agree. That's because it wouldn't occur to Angus to think under otherwise. Because Angus is an extremely nice person. Greg's a nice person. Oh yeah, he definitely is. But he's also bratty and irresponsible, and has like zero attention span. Greg needs a parent as much as he needs a boyfriend, and he's really lucky Angus is a bit of both. Angus, like, thinks Greg, like, saved him. Listen, I'm not saying he didn't, if he thinks so. Angus might also just be attracted to really sincere guys in leather jackets. Who carry knives. I mean, if I met the guy, right guy, who... Those would all be pluses. Geez, you thought this out. Before you came back, they were the only people I hung out with most of the time. Not a lot of time to study. So, like... How are you? I don't even know. I'm still processing. I'm here, though. Yeah. You? Not great? Had a dream the world was ending. Might be. Do you think we're safe? No idea. Great feeling. Yep. It's like, I'm a little confused about what even happened last night. It's apparently... Well, there's apparently a death cult of dads, or was... Who knows if that was all of them. I can't believe they even exist. Or existed. Probably take them a few days to die. Yep. I don't know. I kind of understand them in a weird way. Really? It's like a porch light that's on. And there are these bugs around it. And then the light goes out. And there's a hole where the light was. It's like what happened to me way back. Like I was telling you about uh, on the couch last night. Holy crap, that was last night. Seems like two lifetimes ago. <laughs> yeah. I, I guess. The world is extremely bad. Yes. Yes, it is. Great question. How do you, like, get up every day and go open the store and keep doing it? I don't really have a choice, do I? I guess not. But still, lots of people would be, like, destroyed by what you've been through. My mom was extremely tough and smart. When I found out she was going to die, it just didn't occur to me that she was fragile. Like, we're all fragile. I don't want to let her down, I guess. I can't not give a shit. I mean, I do the store and our bills at home, stuff with the Chamber of Commerce, I'm doing free study courses online, and I'm a member of the Young Socialists. I sleep a lot and sometimes eat pizza. To each according their, to their ability. On the bright side, you got me! Yeah, yeah. We can fix the world together! Yep. Fix it right up. We fixed that furnace. I fixed that furnace. Well, I fixed this getting trapped in the basement. You sure did, May. You sure did. Well, I guess last night wasn't so weird. It was pretty weird. Old men killing the youngs and the poors. To get back some past that barely existed. Same old, same old. They're like ghosts in some old mansion. Killing the new owners. Makes you want to either give up or try harder. Or get really upset and take a nap. 
Yeah, naps fix everything. Or like drop an elevator on him. That works too, I guess. <laughs> that is Wow. So how good is your car? Good how? Like, can it drive real far? Hey, do you know anything about What? We should like do a road trip. So where? Out west. It gets all flat. That it does. We can go where it's really flat and they sell barbecue. <laughs> see the world's largest You see like the world's largest pierogi. Or a museum of toy rocket ships. Or a factory where they make pretzels. Or a house that looks like a big chicken. I could Okay, let's talk about it next year. I'll start planning it now. I thought you couldn't leave the home because of your issue. Eh, you're home enough. I mean, if we're trapped here together, might as well be trapped out there together. I mean, if we're not dead by then. Don't say lol. You have a way of making doom sound like a lot of fun, Mayday. That's actually kind of a gift. <laughs> God damn this door! I think God already has. There they are. Hey guys. Sup, nerds? Uh, how'd you get Angus out of work? I made up a family emergency. My uncle got run over by a tractor. Wow. I mean, he did in real life too, but that was years ago. Hey Greg, so... I didn't really know Casey. Yeah. I just wanted to say I'm really sorry. Yeah. Thanks. Casey was a good one. Casey was good. So, should we, like, tell his parents? Probably? What do we tell them? I don't know. Can we, like, make up something that sounds real? Oh, what, the truth isn't real enough? No, you're right, the truth is insane. <laughs> so, like, what do we do? About Casey? No, like, in general. Can we think about this tomorrow? Can we just play a song and get pizza? I don't think song and pizza is an answer, really. Can we just be normal for like one day? I don't know how today could possibly feel normal. When I was in that coma or whatever, I saw the future. Maybe it's now the future. Or was the future. Like flying cars and shit? Actually, those would be a disaster. <laughs> Finally you admit it! You owe me five bucks! That's a bet. So, it was like the town was abandoned, like being eaten and reclaimed by nature or some shit. I went to where my house used to be. When I was there, I felt completely hopeless, but now I think I could just build another house. I could just move on. Knowing when to hold on and when to let go. Okay, I lost my entire train of thought. I had it for a second, then it was gone. Song and pizza sounds good to me. Song and pizza. Yeah, good enough. God, now I want pizza. Now I actually want pizza. Shit! I don't get to play the song! <sighs> Damn it, I actually want to play the song now. I wanted a song to play. I'm probably not going to get a chance to. But, we have beaten Night in the Woods yet again. And did the, the B route. Didn't think I'd come back to do a, a closer to 100% run. Actually, no, there's not a way to do it. I didn't think I'd come back and see another ending. But I'm glad I did. There's a lot of things in this game that I did not discover the first time and still didn't discover the second time around. So I highly encourage you guys to pick up the game yourself in the description below. Also, Demon Tower is a game that I still need to play. Hopefully after this, I, need, I remember to go back to that. Oh my god. Demon Tower is fun. Like what I what little I played of it was a lot of fun. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so good. Oh my god. Secret lab? Secret lab? What's I need to look that up. Is there any more? Is there any more? Did we get an extra scene at the end with the with the update and stuff? <sighs> okay, there we go. God, I... L I think I said this before, but, like, this game... While it's definitely one of those things you want to play blind, or is, like... Maybe not blind, but, like... 
There's not much... I, no, there is totally replay value. For a story-based game, this is definitely... For a story-based indie game, this is definitely one of the ones that's going down in history is one of my other all-time favorite game aside from Cave Story. And it kind of almost ties, if anything. Oh, I'm, I'm still on the fence about where it is actually on my list of favorite games. It is so good, though. It's tied for first, we'll put it that way. <laughs> Bye, Sharkle. I want a Sharkle shirt now. Rip Casey. Oh, we didn't complete the diary or journal or whatever. I love that Mayday out. That Mayday page. That Mayday page. I want that as my wallpaper. <laughs> I'm going to have to set that as my wallpaper now, aren't I? Rip Casey. What do we got? How many shit do we got? Bruce. Bruce. Oh, right. He was the uh, hobo guy. If I die, Smelter should write a poem about it. <laughs> oh, some of the things changed. Like uh, the Smelter's bit. Rip Granddad, Rip Casey. Aw. Yeah, that's the end of that. Uh, there's also a lot more you can do with Germ, if you remember to do it, like, in the day and all that. I did not remember to do it. Fuck. It's my own fault there. Anyway, this has been Night in the Woods. Second run. Probably, unless there's another major update... I'm probably not going to come back to it, but I will come back for Demon Towers. I need to come back for Demon Towers. I need to start another game, though. <laughs> or do I? Can I just do Demon Towers from here? No, I need to actually load the game. It sucks that I need to actually go into the game and then play Demon Towers that way, but, like, it, it, it's a thing I gotta do. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think. Comments below. Thank you to Shro, Leviel, and Worldly Bird for supporting me on Patreon this month. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!